Good morning, St. Albert the Great, Father S. Doc here. Hope you're having a great week. We are approaching the 33rd Sunday in Ordinary Time this coming weekend, and we have a great parable, one you're probably familiar with. It's the parable of the talents. Remember, the master was going away, and he gave his uh, servants uh, various numbers of talents. So he gave 10 to one, five to the other, and one to the third. And, of course, he went away on a journey, and he came back, and he took an accounting. And what he found out is that the one with 10 made it more 10. Five made it into five more. And the one who got the least out of fear buried it and didn't turn it in. He said, here's your talent back. So the moral of the story might be for us is that we cannot be lazy or afraid to take the gifts that God has given us and to build up the kingdom of God. I think that's the religious message. But we might be uh, translating it for our day and age into the fact that God is never going to call you to something in your life that he hasn't given you the gifts and the grace to accomplish. You know, um, I used to ask uh, young uh, men all the time, would you like to be a priest when you grow up? And they immediately say, oh, no, I want to be an astronaut. I want to be a football player. I want to be, I don't know, something. I don't ask them that anymore. What I ask them is, do you think that Jesus might be calling you to be a priest? Well, wow, that's not such an easy answer. You notice I'm not saying, what do you want? I'm asking you, what is God calling you to in your life? So that's a different project. So the first and most important thing that we need to do is to find out what is it that God is calling me to. And then we can look to find the gifts of our lives and the grace of our lives to accomplish it. All right, I hope you will all spend some time this week thinking about what it is that God wants for your life. And then go ahead and start looking for the gifts and asking for the grace to accomplish God's will. All right, take care.